The industry's reputation is still not great, unfortunately, um, particularly to the man on the street that hasn't had any particular interaction mm. with people in, in the companies. Mm. How much of an issue is that uh, as you look forward to the work that you're going to be doing? If you're a patient and you're chronically ill, I can say it till I'm blue in the face, if you're a patient and you're chronically ill, you don't care possibly who's making you that drug. I can tell you I just wanted the drug. I wanted to get home and I wanted to get better. I, I didn't care if it was red or blue or whichever brand, that, that didn't matter to me. Um, but it starts to matter if you can't get it or it's a rarer condition um, or if it's not working for you uh, or you're highly um, engaged in your care and a condition you had for a long time where you want to see what's new and, and what's kind of coming out. And, and there are different levels of patients being engaged in their care, which, which is another kind of conversation entirely. Pharmaceutical companies' reputation um, hasn't historically been fantastic. We know if you look at the average graph, it kind of goes banking and then pharma. And Now, it kind of doesn't really matter, as I said, in some ways. Some people will argue that the more patients do the Googling and the more they become in touch with their health care and understand health as a tangible issue then they may also be more interested in the brands and the companies that kind of create those because it's not you know the idea of moving from patient to having somebody maybe in between a physician or a healthcare professional or a nurse or even a pharmacist and perhaps moving those and having that direct relationship between pharma and patient you know not even like a US model but a relationship where patients are actively talking on forums about brands and they are actively engaging in the healthcare in a very very different way especially if we look to the different generations then maybe reputation and branding of companies will play a bigger part but we have had letters from patients saying how happy they've been and that's incredible. So we know that there is recognition um, and the reputation piece, um, it only bothers me if it affects patients not being able to get the drugs that, that we think that they should be able to access. Mm -hmm.